All right, so we finally got some of the bigger equipment hooked up now. Setting up the bandsaw, tighten this up. One of the things I want to do in the new shop is get the table clean, get it all the rust off of it, and then re-wax the table. It's important to wax the table every once in a while, make sure it's nice and clean. I've got some watermarks from having this in the garage last time. So I'm going to use this stuff called Bow Shields. It's out of, uh, I think, Holland, Michigan. Used this before. Spray this on, picks up all the rust, wipe it off, and then you seal it, and you've got a nice smooth table, easier to work on. But we're going to go ahead and clean this up with the dust collector, and then I'll show you guys how I use this. Alright, so the way you use this rust-free bow shields is you spray it on. We're just going to let this sit for about three or four minutes. We'll come back, we'll wipe some of it off. If I got really bad stains, I'll get a scrub, scrub brush and clean it off. I don't think any of this is too bad. We'll just let this sit for a little bit, we'll come back. All right, so that was about four minutes. You can see how much this takes off. All the rust on the back here is gone. Look at that. Nice and clean. The back side here is a little ugly. A little bit more on the back here. Let that sit. All right, so I got my Home Depot scrub brush. And we'll just scrub off what's ever left. We'll just wipe this off. You can see how much cleaner the scrub side is than the non-scrub side. Might as well do it all over the place, actually. Looks so much better. So we'll let that sit another five minutes and then re-scrub the whole top. All right, another four minutes, scrub this clean. All I will finish wiping this up here. See how much more rust and debris I pull up here. The dries, you could just use a little bit more to wipe this up.
Lots of garbage on this today. All right, so next up we're gonna apply the T9 waterproof lubrication. I shake this up, spray it on. Let it sit for a minute. We'll get a clean paper towel and we'll wipe it in. It's a nice waterproof lubrication. I'll just rub this in. Clean the bar as well so this slides a little bit smoother. And the way I rub this in is I just rub it in until there's sort of no residue left. I'll just let it sit and dry. In a couple hours the top will be all ready to use. So you can see how much better this slides now. So there we go, we'll let this sit for about two, three hours, let this dry off nicely. They'll be all sealed, ready to go. Thanks for watching guys, we'll see you in the next vid.